Howdy folks, it's Nito with AP 2020 Outdoors Adventures. So what I'm doing this morning, I've got, actually I've got three now, but I've got two Lehigh Defense uh, bullets I'm testing. My uh, primary coyote load is 168 grain controlled fracturing. And then now I also have a Lehigh Defense 194 grain maximum expansion. And the cool thing about my Pulsar Apex XD75 thermal scope is that I can store three different gun sight settings. Acre in controlled fracturing, 50 yards. Checking the side end. Pulsar Apex XE75 thermal. All right. See what we did there. All right. So this is at 50 yards. I'm just going to mark these 168. And then I'll go back and uh, re-side in for my 194. Side in for the 168 grain control fracturing. So I'm 7, plus 7 on the X and minus Y on the 2. So I'll go ahead and, that was that gun sight 1. So I'm going to go ahead, right now I'm on 1. I'm going to switch to... Uh, Three, that's going to be my 194 grain max maximum expansion. Go back up. So I'm going to start out seven and minus two and see where that hits. All right, here we go. Get the pip going on. All right, let's see how that did. All right, so these are the 194 grain maximum expansion. Oh, that's awesome. So that's 194. 194. And one of these was 194. So actually, the zeros are pretty doggone close, which is awesome. All right, folks. Well, this is a pretty cool experiment I just did. I've tried something new. I tried a piece of aluminum foil. I cut a hole in the center. That didn't show up. But, you know, obviously, I was trying to center my crosshairs on the center of this rectangle piece of aluminum foil. And I'm very happy with these results. My impacts are about 3 inches high at 50 yards. Would put me about 2 inches low at 100. Plenty accurate for coyote minute of kill. This is Nito with AP 2020 Outdoors Adventures. Hope you all enjoy the video. Thank you.